Well, a terrifying start to the new year along Japan's west coast, which was struck by more than a dozen powerful earthquakes today. The quakes killed at least four people now and prompted tsunami warnings. WGN's Sean Lewis has more, including some eyewitness accounts. The New Year's Day trembler hit in the afternoon, centered in the Sea of Japan and impacting the country's west coast. Japan's prime minister urging residents of the low-lying areas there to evacuate over fears of a tsunami. Just started very slowly. And, and, and everybody kind of left it off. American Daniel Smith, who lives in Tokyo now, was visiting a shrine to celebrate the new year when the ground began to shake. And at first, people just were stunned. And, at the, and, and they kept trying to go to the shrine. They, you know, everybody was standing in line pretty much in just Japan. But what happened is that, that all of a sudden they had another shake and then people just started, you know, they were, they were asking around what to do. And then finally one of the priests came out and said, run, you know, and basically everybody just started running. The series of quakes, the strongest being a preliminary magnitude 7.6, causing injuries and damage, setting off several building fires and causing pipes to burst and leak, including at this train station. This quake bringing back memories of the devastating 8.9 magnitude quake in March of 2011, which triggered a tsunami that hit Japan's northeast coast and led to the triple meltdown of the Fukushima nuclear plant. 19,000 people died in the wake of the tragedies then. Holy f For now, the worst seems to be over, with nerves rattled on this first day of 2024. It just didn't feel normal. This felt more significant than that. And it felt a lot more dangerous. As those who live here hope the worst is behind them. Sean Lewis, WGN News.